dear soon-to-be husband. The day we've been preparing for is finally here. As we unite as husband and wife, I thank God for a man who is devoted to the Lord and has been practicing self-sacrificing love since we started dating six years ago. He always makes me feel so loved, and I know that love will only grow as we enter into marriage and grow closer to Christ together. I know there will never be a dull moment with you. I am so extremely proud of everything you have accomplished so far, and I cannot wait to be with you for all the rest of your accomplishments as we start our best adventure yet. I can't wait for everything that God has planned for us as a couple. Our future family is so lucky to have you as the head of our family. I love you so, so much, and I can't even explain it in words. Love, soon to be Mrs. Lockman. When we met on Tuesday, June 17th, 2014, little did I know that I'd be marrying the most joyous and wonderful woman almost seven years later. I was admittedly quite slow to come around to your pretty obvious flirting that fall, but I'm so glad that I did. God works in mysterious ways, sometimes even through Twitter and Starburst rappers, and I feel so blessed to be able to say that we have reached this day, March 20th, 2021. Please always point me to Christ through your actions, words, and love. If we help one another get to heaven, then we will have succeeded in this marriage. I'm wishing you got speed, glory. There will be mountains you That we've waited for You buried the night And came with the morning You're the king of heaven The praise is yours The longer the quiet The louder the chorus so song with hallelujahs flow like a river we're coming back to 
to life, reaching toward the light. Your love is like springtime. You're the living water, God. We thirst for you. The dry and the barren will flower and bloom. You're the sun that's shining. You restore my soul. The deeper you call us, oh, the deeper we'll go. We will sing a new song. Garden, and like a garden, I will. 